Once the modeling part is done, the 2D plan drawings need to be created. With Alplan Road Design, all drawing outputs are always generated from the latest state of the model. As like the modeling templates, also the drawing output templates and report templates are administrated in the Road Project Manager. With the right mouse click in the navigation tree, new templates can be created. Like this, it is also possible to load predefined configurations that are delivered with the version. In this example, we load one predefined template for each drawing perspective. For every drawing template, a certain scale factor can be defined. This can be useful for the creation of longitudinal drawings when the scale factor in set direction should be drawn exaggerated compared to the values in x direction. Once a template was created or loaded, multiple components can be added to it. For the longitudinal and cross-section drawing templates, the components can be distinguished between tabular and graphics components. While tabular components can be added via right mouse click on the entry drawing components, all graphics components need to be added via right mouse click in the graphic parts entry. In this example, we add one additional tabular component to show the global coordinates for every cross-section drawing. Once a component was added to the list, all component-specific properties can be adjusted to the user requirements. Here we adjust the height of the row and the text size of the coordinate values. After configuring the template in the Road Project Manager, it can be applied for the model. For it, the corresponding draw functions are used. Once the axis is selected and the data range is defined, all plan outputs are automatically generated from the predefined template. This can be done for the longitudinal, the cross-section and the plan layout drawing simultaneously. Besides creating the drawing outputs, also road data reports can be used to derive model information. For it, we also create a new report template. In the next step, the report type has to be defined. Depending to the requested data information, attribute reports, station reports or section reports can be used. With station reports, punctual and linear model information can be derived at certain stations. With a section report, data in projection direction such as volumes can be evaluated. With the icon Add Data, the specific components can be added to the dedicated report. For this example, we create one report to deviate station data and another one to calculate the required excavation and fill volumes in the section report. As like for the drawing templates, also the report templates need to be applied to the model. The report result can be saved in CSV format or simply copied into an Excel sheet. For it, the hotkey Ctrl A and Ctrl C copies the whole table to the clipboard. If the templates are supposed to be reused also on other projects and other workstations, they can easily be saved as favorite and transferred. 
To do that, we select the relevant template in the Road Project Manager and add it to the favorites via a right mouse click. Once a template has been added to favorites, it can be exported to a JSON file and consecutively imported on another workstation.